Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Chelsea and if you're new around here, we'd like to do beauty related content on this channel. If that's something that you like, then please hit subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, then please click on the little bell and you'll be notified of every time they upload. So usually, yes, beauty content, but today we've got an exciting haul because it's the start of my favorite season. It's the start of autumn. It's not officially autumn until September 22nd, I think. But 1st of September, I'm in the mood, I'm in the autumn mood. And even though it's absolutely muggy and so hot, I want to be cozy. I want to light my candles, I want to drink my pumpkin spice lattes and I want to wear all the knitwear that I possibly can and just love like the crisp autumn leaves and the frosty sunny mornings with the crisp air. Oh. I absolutely love it so much. Bought loads of stuff to decorate the house with. Now I thought I'd give you a quick haul. Uh, there's a few more things that I want to add to my list before I fully decorate and we're waiting for our sofas to be delivered on Saturday. So I will show you a video of it all decorated or I will post it on my home Insta account which I'll link down below. But yes, so if you want to see what I got from HomeSense, Asda, The Range, Primark, Next, then please stay tuned. I've got to mention the new Starbucks autumn cups. So this is what it looks like. So it's like the gold with um, like burnt orange maple leaves on, which look really, really cute. And then you've got the Starbucks logo down here, like a, a bright orange straw. And yeah, I think this was only £6.50. I'm very much an iced coffee drinker these days very, compared to like a hot coffee. So I thought this was perfect. I was gonna get an autumnal mug, but then I don't really drink hot drinks anymore. I drink cold drinks. So I thought this would be perfect for it. And then at least it's not going to waste. To go with that, obviously with my iced lattes in the morning, white chocolate pumpkin skinny syrup. Now these skinny syrups from Jordan's are unreal. You always get them in like TK Maxx and HomeSense. And they had a bunch of them as well. White chocolate pumpkin. I remember having this flavor, I think like a year or two ago. And it was so, so tasty. So yeah, I picked up one of these. This was £4.49 from home sense and then i also got well home sense slash tk Maxx. it's all the same um and then i got this to bake so the ice cinnamon ice donut cookies which i thought would be really really nice to make when i'm decorating the house and this was only two pound fifty for the mixture so i'm so excited to try these out so i brought this cute little brassy pear so this is five pound 99 and you can put like a pillar candle inside or you could just leave it like that but i just thought i don't know if a pear is a seasonal fruit for this season because i've but i have seen a few other pears about um but i just think the style of it like the brassiness and things like that and it was in the autumn halloween stuff so it must be that season but yeah i just thought it was really cute especially with like a little candle inside now i think this is going to be one of my favorite purchases but this is a martha stewart white pumpkin soy blend candle so you just pop open the lid and there's the candle inside it's got three wicks and as soon as you open it you can smell it and it smells absolutely divine oh it smells so nice and it's so heavy as well it's like proper ceramic so this will go nicely as an ornament and as a candle and it was 12 pound 99 um but yeah i believe they had these on last year as well so if you had your eye on them last year go there now because they're selling like hot cakes but yeah this is I think one of my favourite purchases. Now, I love jars like this. I always have them out at Christmas and I fill them with sweets. But this one, I think I'm going to fill with something else, which I'll show you in a minute. But it's like a nice big glass jar with like a pumpkin lid and like gold um, surrounding. And this was only £6.99. It's quite a large jar as well. But yeah, something just to put on the table perhaps or around the fireplace. I'm not too sure where I'm going to put this yet but I will find it home and I just couldn't not take it because I love a good big glass jar. And then I got another candle which is gonna go here because I've got like some black bits, black frames and a black candle already there. So I'm gonna place that one with this one. And this is the hand poured wax pumpkin and spice. Harvest pumpkin swirls with cinnamon, nutmeg and aromatic spice candle and i just think the um the candle itself just looks really really nice with a nice wooden lid and like a stamping in there. 
and it smells it's not as strong as the others but i don't think i'll burn this one i think i just have it out for the decoration but inside it's a black candle with a white wick and yeah it just smells like pumpkin spice but this one was it is 7.99 it was and it's from the m of wg brand so yeah i just thought this would look really spooky but cute and then the last of the candles was this huge one from sand and fog and i like the fact it's got a painted harvesty lid on top and this flavor is pumpkin harvest inside it's a huge white candle with four wicks and again this smells so nice but this one was 14.99 so more expensive out of the three but it just looks so pretty and i think i'm gonna put this on my console tables in the um, hallway really really cute candle there okay so the one thing that i picked up from the range a bag of potpourri and this is pumpkin spice scented potpourri not a lot of people like him but i love potpourri i love filling vases with them and this one is all like brown and gold with a little bit of orange like a burnt orangey bit to it and i thought that maybe i could fill up this jar with this potpourri and maybe put like a little bit of fairy lights in there or something like that something cute um but yeah i just thought it was a nice idea maybe just like some of the wooden bits like the pine cones and the wood flowers and stuff like that rather than like the big gold bowls uh, balls maybe i'll put them somewhere else but yeah definitely like the pine cones and stuff i definitely want to fill it into that jar and then the one thing i got from next was the big famous wicker pumpkin and the lid actually comes off so you can store some stuff in there which i don't know what i'd store in there to be honest but this one was 28 pounds and a little bit more pricey than what i'd hoped but it is next and i know that this is something that i'll be able to reuse every year because it's really good quality but yes absolutely love this pumpkin it definitely goes with the decor of my house and then the thing that i got from wilco's was just these woven wicker um seagrass coasters because we needed some coasters to be fair and i've got seagrass style coasters on um placemats on my table so i thought they would go nicely onto the table as well asda is popping off at the moment like asda's autumn stuff is actually really really nice so the first thing i got was this blanket and it is well it's like a throw and it's so it's so fluffy and really, really soft. And the detail on it has got like hedgehogs and um, mini mushrooms and autumn leaves and stuff like that. And this was only £6.99. It's such good quality. And oh my God, I just hope, well, I just can't wait to snuggle up into it. Watching my autumnal films with my pumpkin spice latte in my hand and a nice candle burning. Now, if that doesn't sound like a perfect night, don't talk to me because that is my perfect night. But yeah, it's just on my new sofas as well. And it's just so, so soft. So yeah, really, really excited to get this one out when the sofas arrive. And then I've got this little sign as well, which I think I'm going to put um, in the hallway as well. And it just says, hello, autumn. And this, I think, was like £7 or something from Asda as well, um, which I thought was really, really cute. And then I did get this big black ceramic dish. So this, I was thinking of putting this onto my coffee table and getting some white, um, mini white pumpkins to put inside with maybe like a few pine cones or something. And I think that would make a really nice um, dis display, like centre display of my coffee table. But yeah, trying to find mini white foam or mini white knitted pumpkins, it's really hard without spending loads of money. So, because I think I'll need quite a few to fill up these, but there were like three little tiny ones for like 10 or 15 pounds. I just think that's really expensive. I would have thought I would have been able to get a big pack of them for about 10 pounds. But I'm still going to search. So as soon as that's done, then I'll upload the photo on my home account. So this is another thing that I got from the range actually, and it's a big... Um, like autumnal LED leaf garland so it actually does light up once you put batteries in it and yeah I just really like the colours I'm going to put this over my fireplace which I think is going to look so cute when I light my fireplace and, um, and with like my white company winter candles so this one was only pretty sure it was only £15 or something like that and it's 180 centimetres and I've also got this eucalyptus um, garland as well, which I actually bought a few months ago for a baby shower. So, and I thought I'd keep it because I knew that I'd use it. And then I just thought about why don't I put 
Well, on my table, I've got my wicker placemat, my seagrass placemats with my black long skinny candles. And then I'm going to have my muslin cloth, like beige runner. And maybe that just running through the center. I don't know. Maybe that's what I'll do. Or maybe I'll stick it on another console table or something. I'm not too sure yet. But I think this will be added benefit. I don't know whether to spray paint it. Like um, an autumnal colour or just to leave it green. But yeah, got that. I think these were only like a couple of quid from Hobbycraft. And then the last thing I got was this really cute like hoop. Is it like a hoop wreath? It doesn't really say. This was £6 from Primark. I don't know whether to put this on my front door yet. Like with a bit of... Um, brown string um, and hang it onto my front door or if I want to do it on an internal door. I'm not too sure. I don't know if it'll get ruined outside so I don't know if it's meant to be outside or not. But it is really really pretty. I do wish it was like the whole ring um, but again it was only £6 and reefs are so expensive and I just can't find one that I really like without spending like 60 quid, which I'm not going to do. Um, so yeah so I've got this one for the meantime but I don't know I might wrap some string around this bit. Oh it's got some string here to be fair actually and that's what it looks like yeah I think I will put it on my front door it is really really pretty and yeah only six pounds can't really go wrong right that's the end of my autumn haul I hope you enjoyed it if you did please make sure you give it a big thumbs up and I'll let you know how I get on with my cinnamon iced donut cookie mix I might again post like a reel or something on my home account a lot of autumn inspired stuff will be on my home account which again I will link down below my at and home on Instagram and yeah thank you so much for watching and hopefully I shall see you in my next video. Bye!